Here are a couple of reasons why I hate Valorant players. Yoru players. I fully agree with you on every point you brought up except on the Yoru. Usually Everything people is fine, Yoru, but not the Yoru. Because, Yoru, Yoru, because I think Yoru is a bad got me angry. Okay, so y'all really bullied me into playing Yoru, so for the next 10 hours, that's exactly what I'm going to do. But unlike the previous Cypher challenge, I am not going to set any goals for myself, because if you expect nothing, you can never be disappointed. The only thing I would like to do is one of those fake clone things, where you pretend that you are the clone, and then you turn around and kill them. Power 1 was used to conduct a plan, and the plan was simple. Buy a shorty, put the teleport behind your opponent, flash your opponent, teleport behind them and kill them. And then in the next four hours, I use this strategy with pretty, you know, just see for yourself. Now game one was absolutely atrocious, but I want you to know that what you're about to see doesn't represent the whole video. It gets better, I promise. I am so f***ing dead. This is gonna be a long day. I started off game two by losing a 4v1 in the pistol round. No way! GG's were already being thrown in the chat. But luckily, we won the eco round, but then lost the next round. We were giving away rounds more easily than Adam22 gives away his wife. But on the positive note, I started feeling a bit more comfortable in Yoru, giving us our first win. And mine is GG's. 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 The next game was the complete opposite of the previous game, as I opened up with a 1v3 clutch in the pistol. Oh, nice. And this momentum carried on for the rest of the game. Minus Well, until it didn't, and we lost. But nothing could have prepared me for what was about to happen next. I want you guys to comment if I was in the wrong, and if I was, then listen, I don't want to be right. Can you give it to me? Oh, t'inquiète même pas que tu perds ta game, toi, au Give me your gun. Good luck to win that. Good luck. It's going gay. What the fuck are you doing, sir? Shut the fuck up. Give Why? it to me. Why? I dropped a gun. Give back my... Give back are my... Are you dumb? You're you gonna lose this. Stop crying, you boy. I don't care, you're gonna lose. Be useful. After this little civilized conversation, I kinda became an asshole. But, you know, I feel like under the given circumstances, it's quite forgivable. Fake, fake, fake. Okay, just don't make time. Come back, come back, fake. You just kill him. What do you mean, fake? Oh, bro, you you don't listen to my call. Well, you could have just killed him. Yeah, but they killed you, so we can't. Yeah, no shit. And somehow, by some miracle, we actually won the game. For the first time in this challenge, I got flamed for Nisalaking Yoru. I shit on Yoru. I shit on Yoru. No, 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 no. I shit so much on Yoro. What the fuck did I do? Bro, you're insane, Loki. 
But as a master negotiator, I made a deal. A promise, per se. A promise that I intended to keep. And take a good combo or... or Bro, I have a last round, instant uh, neon lock. They say, they told me they're playing good. Bro, <laughs> 320, 320, what the fuck, man? Bro, I'm gonna get at least five kills. At least five. At least it's not very good five. Okay, make it six. Okay, six I hope good. for you, I hope for you, you're playing good. When not, bro, I trash talking. There's so much pressure now. However, 10 rounds deep and only four kills to my name, I felt like a fraud. I went to the bathroom, looked at the man in the mirror and told him to get his shit together. And from that point forward, I slowly but steady started to complete my promise. Oh, yeah, I fuck my flesh. Yeah, my word, you thought. Right, man, hit. What the fuck out here, my word? I say it, I'm hanging. Let me knife. Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. No, no, no. In hour five, I thought it would be a good idea to not only play Yoru, but also live like a Yoru player. I instantly imagined a Gen Z skinny kid with bleach hair, or in other words, TikTok. And let me tell you, I found something pretty cool. Photoshop has this new feature where you can use AI to add whatever you want to your photos. Or you can even let the AI decide what will be the next logical pixel. So to try it out, I got this photo of a nice lady acting surprised, and I let AI generate the remaining of the photo. And we got a sweatshop. But instead of little Chinese children, we got a creepy looking white woman. I guess she felt like she knew just as much about working in a sweatshop in China as the children themselves. After all, she's walked a mile in their shoes. That's fucked up. In the remaining four hours, I played a couple of games with my friend, Baba Bowie. And also, while we're on the topic about AI, can somebody please explain to me why, when I'm playing, I feel pretty smooth? Like, my crosshair placement is decent, my movement is pretty good. But now that I'm watching this gameplay back, I look like a complete bot. Not a good kind, more like a one created in an incel's basement. Like he was trying to program a sex slave, but instead this is what he got. Like, this shit makes no sense. Also, uh, by the way, I haven't been following the plan that I made at the start of the challenge. Well, that is because I made it after playing all these games. Why, you may be asking. Well, because I didn't know what to put in the intro. But I did try the fake clone thing once, and this is how it went. Okay, let's do it. Uh, why is this following me now? <laughs> Does that even count? After the 10 hours, I was still in the same rank that I started in, which, which is quite sad. You know, I'm seeing all these videos pop up of like, oh, classic to immortal, knife to radiant. And I'm like, am I actually that bad? Anyways, conclusion, because every story needs an ending, right? The whole point of this challenge was to see if my viewers were right. And I mean, Yoru is definitely more fun than Cypher, but that's like saying that a moldy piece of bread is better than a handful of poop. But that's enough for today. I want you guys to comment what agent I should learn next. And by learning, I mean simply playing, because I ain't learning shit. Or preferably, what game I should learn next. You know, I wanted to do this video where I learned Overwatch for 7 days. And mate, I, I played one game, and I wanted to join the Suicide Squad. So, anything but that.